this video, I want to show you how to use the Illumination Virtual Manipulative for equivalent fractions. So I downloaded this through iTunes, and Illuminations is from the National Council of the Teachers of Mathematics, and I'm ready to use my app. So I tap on it, and equivalent fractions, the, the default is square and automatic. We'll go for that. Play. And with this button, I generate different problems. This is the fraction that I'm currently being given, 14 sixteenths, and it's been drawn here as one division vertically and 16 divisions horizontally, and I'm to make two equivalent fractions with different denominators, so I can't use 16. So the first thing I could say is 14 over 16 is 7 over 8, so I could work on this one and make it 7 eighths depending on whether I want to go 8 this way or 8 this way or I could do 4 and 2 so let's do 4 and 2 so I want to make this 4 and this 2 so the first thing I take my joystick and I move it to the right until I get 4 and then I move it up until I get 2 and so I want 7 eighths so I would block off 7 of these and it's the same one so I've got one done then I could go to this one, and I could say, oh, let's make it 28 32s. 32s would mean I'd have to make 32 one way, or I would have to say 16 one way and the other way 2. Let's go for 16, because it looks like 32 is going to be very small. And then 2 this way. And now, how many do I need? I need 28 of those, because 2 times 16 is 32. So 2 times 14 is 28, but I can pick any ones I want. So let me pick all these here. So how many would be left? 28 out of 32. I've got to leave 4 empty. So 1. There we go. So I've got 4 empty, and I'm good. And I check it down here says that one's good and that one's good and then I can look at my report here and as you can see I've already done three practice problems before I recorded this and that's how to use the virtual manipulative equivalent fractions